A diminished sales forecast by industrial bellwether Caterpillar has clouded stocks in the US, but a last minute burst of buying pushed the Dow and S&P 500 barely back into the black for the session. The Dow Jones Industrial Average finished up two points at 13,345. In initial trading, the ASX 200 index is currently up nine points at 4,550. In company news, Oz Minerals said today it was on track to meet annual guidance for copper and gold output despite production volume slipping in the third quarter from a year earlier. Copper output for the three months to September 30 was 25,738 metric tonnes, more than the 25,521 tonnes produced in the second quarter, and beating consensus forecasts of 25,300 tonnes. Shares in OZL are up 24 cents to $8.53. In other news, Insurance Australia Group says it is on track to achieve its full year financial forecast after the first quarter of performance. Chief Executive Mike Wilkins told the company's annual general meeting that IAG had begun the 2012-2013 financial year as expected. According to the CEO, the company is on track to deliver full year guidance of an imp improved insurance margin of 11 to 13% and gross written premium growth of 9 to 11%. Shares in IAG are up $0.03 cents to $4.57. In the local currency, the Australian dollar is up against the greenback this morning, currently buying 103.31 US cents. I'm Tom Wood for Baker Young Stockbrokers.